have you been told to use Vancouver referencing in your medical assignments, but don't know anything about the formatting structure? Don't worry today we will learn about the style mostly used in the medical field, which is Vancouver referencing styles that will take your assignment game to the top. Vancouver style was previously known as the recommendations for the conduct, reporting, editing, and publication of scholarly work in medical journals. This style originated in Vancouver, by the editors of medical journals and, at present, is used by more than 1,000 medical journals. For example, the National Library of Medicine, the American Medical Association, NEDGM, etc. Vancouver style referencing can be used in both in-text and reference list. Whichever type you choose to incorporate in your assignments, both these types will have a number assigned to each of the citations as they are used. The original number that was assigned to a citation will be used each time that particular citation is used in the text. Now, we will move on to its examples. This is how we cite in books from both the in-text and reference list perspective. This is how we cite in journal from both the in-text and reference list perspective. This is how we cite in images or videos from both the in-text and reference list perspective. This is how we cite in websites from both the in-text and reference list perspective. This how we cite in blogs from both the in-text and reference list perspective. This how we cite in dictionary from both the in-text and reference list perspective. Hope you learned everything about Vancouver referencing style. Thank you for watching and if you learned from our video, like share and subscribe to our channel instant assignment help.